tafadhali tujulishe wewe ni nani na jamaa zako hawa ni kina nani uh, asante sana nashukuru citizen mimi naitwa mzee asin jama ame kenya uh, mimi nimefanya biashara uh, nafanya kazi ya biashara at the same time i'm an opinion leader also i had uh, about three young men in that office of Adam Smith's offices, which was in the complex with this uh, uh, Dusit Hotel. Uh, about nine, uh, about 3.30 or th uh, let's say 3.20 something, I did get a call from a young man, my own son, by the name Mahamud Yasin Jama, called me, Baba, Kunashida, Kunashida, Kunashida. Kuna nini? Kuna terrorist, terrorist. I was so shocked. So shocked in the sense that I don't know how I felt. I don't have a word to explain my feelings at that particular moment. But I was so overwhelmed that I couldn't move even my legs. I couldn't stand up. Within the next seven or nine minutes, he told me, God bless, I am out of danger. But in Baya, Kulikwa na wana vijana wa wili, waduguzake nyamayake hasa wa karibu, ambao waliko kwenye iyo mahali. Hawa wili walikufa. Sababu nilikuwa hapa jana usiku mpaka saa nani. Na leo ni mamukia asubuhi, ni kuchukua mwili wa hawa vijana wangu, ambao umeuliwa na hawa materis jana jana ni bahati mbaya sisi wa na Kenya tunafata fatwa na sana na hawa watu waliumiza watu wengi sana miaka hizo zilizopita huko pwani pia inaendelea tu imeturudia jana uh, mimi nimepoteza wawili on these terrorists by religion, I'm a Muslim. Kuzaliwa, mini mutu wa North Eastern. Unesema msomali. But I'm Kenyan Somali. Tukwa na shida. Tumapoteza wa toto. Wa Kenya wangini walipoteza. Tukwa pa moja tunauliwa na hawa watu. A terrorist does not have. Hana dini, hana rangi, wala hana kabila. Mara ingini tunakuwaga, tunakuwaga victims vile tuko leo. Na at the same time, kuna wale ambao na tushuku sisi ambao na tuambia terrorist. Akiwana mimi niko na mavazi ya kislamu, anafikiri mimi ni terrorist. I'm a victim of a terrorist. Kwa hiyo, tuko na hiyo shida. Ki mila ya kislamu. We are supposed to be burying these uh, young men today. Tunasema wa Kenya wajue ya kwamba hata mimi ni maumia watoto wangu ni mapoteza na mimi siyo terrorist. They don't do it selectively. Hawataki sisi wote wana tuchukia. Islam does not condone Terrorism. We don't have any verse in the Quran that tells me to kill someone else. Hakuna. It is just, you know, the mindset that has been set by the Western media that when you hear a terrorist, what automatically comes to your mind is Muslim. Unaangaliam Islam, unaangaliam miskiti, unaona mama ambaya akona boy boy. Unaona mzo ingini ambayo hako na kofi wa uwa kakuna kanzo. So, they identified us with the terrorists. But I can say, we are not terrorists. Sisi wa Kenya, tunaomba tafadhalini. To see where sisi, victims are the same time suspects. Victims are not the same time suspects. Tukai pa moja, tusaidiani. Ili tuwafate hawa watu ambao sasa wanatuletea uharibifu kila mwaka. Why should we wait for these people 
to come all the way from Somalia to the heart of Kenya, Nairobi, and specifically selected very, very important areas to blow up and to kill people. Why don't we follow them up to their hideouts and kill them there and there, there and there, to a Malizo huko huko? Mimi, nashukuru sana mulinipatia yu fursa. Ninaongea kwa ile feelings yangu ambaye niko nae. Ninaongea juu ya ile feeling ya community yangu vile tunafeel. Tunaangaliwa na macho waswazi. Anakuona muke nyangini, amapoteza mtu. Leo ananiangalia na ana, anaona ananiangalia na macho waswazi. Anaona mimi ndio ni dugu yake ile mtu ambaye ameuwe dugu ya mtu wangu mimi. This is my son. You see that one? Ambaye anava kanzo. He has been working in the same office with those guys ambao wale watu ambao wameuliwa jana. Kwa hiyo asanteni sana na shukuru. I think you can portray the same. You can portray the real Muslims, not the terrorists. Asante sana. Kabla uende mzee, pengine kidogo hawa vijana wawili ambao leo mnawapumzisha ulikuwa unawafahamu na walikuwa watu wa aina gani? Pengine utuelezee machache tu kwa uso. walikuwa vijana wazuri sana. Ni vijana ambao walizaliwa na walisoma hapa. Mungeni ako na degree mungeni ni master's degree. Moja wao aliyo juzi juzi tu na mpaka sasa hajapata mtoto but he has a wife. How do you feel when your son ambaye ulimwezesha juzi anauliwa na terrorist? I feel very bitter. Very very bitter. But it has happened. Ni something that happens. Uh, how vijana ni vijana mzuri sana we have lost vijana wazuri kabisa we have lost resources tumepoteza watu ambao wamelimika na walikuwa wanatufanyia kazi one of them was the only breadwinner of a very big family of about 23 people 23 kwa hiyo nashukuru i think you can release me 